located in near Uhuru grounds lies this building that was built here many years ago. This building, since its establishment and since it was built, we haven't seen any importance that has been inside here. Once it was named that this during a signboard that was placed there, that this place was said to be an industrialization center where people who were working in the Juakali industry could come do their work here. That's why the government established this center. But many years later, now the situation stands this, and the situation is there here. The windows are no longer there. The building is being broken down each day and each night by different peoples who come and do some nasty things here. During our spot check that we have done severally, here this is the situation, so pathetic. A place that is meant to help our youth, a place that is meant to help these people. Uh, people from Isiolo County now is turning out to be a place where a lot of nasty thing is being done. This place is a threat to the people. And when we enter this place, you can find the dirt that starts from the door and you can see how that this place is. A lot of stones being placed here. The shoes are found here. Look at, it's done to be like a dustbin center. A place where it was one time established to be an industrialization center where the Juakali people could come and do their work. Even at how it was being built. It was built in a way that it was meant to help the people. The ventilators, how the doors, the windows were placed from both behind and the front side. But now this is the place that people have left it ago. Where is the county government of Isiolo? No one cares about this place. This place needs assistance, assistance that should be rescued because it's now becoming a threat to the resident of this area whereby this place borders the Isiolo LMB road and those people who pass here have been continuously having fear because this is a threat. You don't know who is, being, who is hiding here. This place, even the fence has gone down and the youth sometimes, many unknown people have come and stolen different things. As you can see, even the doors and the windows have been stolen from this place. Even this is a meter box, was meant to supply electricity, but it never happened. Look at how inside it, now turning to be a store of stones, so pathetic. The county government should have come and rescued this place a long time ago so that the people could get assistance from this area. But once they leave it to the resident to take a decision among us itself, this place is going to be a place that is going to create a threat to these people because it's going to serve as a place where people are going to hide and do a lot of nasty things. During our spot checks, we have come up with a lot of activities that is being carried out here during the day and during the night. If this situation continues to be like this, then who is to be blamed? We will continue updating you on this pathetic situation as we continue asking the county government of Isolo to come into this matter and try to raise a lot of issues and revive this matter or totally bring it down so that people could have peace and it will no longer be a threat. But a building like this remain to be left out to people to do the nasty things and activities that are not beneficial, then this place is going to be turned to an evil center. And once that is turned, the youth and many other people will face a lot of challenges that will later result to a lot of different things. Reporting from Isiolo, my name is Galgalo Guyo Ali, reporting for Truth News TV, Kenya Investigative Desk.